Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel Tech Tips with Kuwin. In today's video, I want us to look at scanning QR codes on Android smartphones. Now, a QR code, which is the abbreviation for Quick Response Code, is a matrix barcode and it's easily readable with digital devices like smartphones. Nowadays, there is a proliferation of QR codes. We see them on websites. You can use them to connect to Wi-Fi networks. If you want to send or receive cryptocurrency, you can use a QR code to get the wallet address. You can also send music files or images using QR codes, etc. So QR codes are literally everywhere. Therefore, um, naturally, um, there are tons of QR code readers out there. As a matter of fact, if we search for QR code scanners in the Google Play Store, the results are endless. A lot of people rush to download these apps. However, you most likely don't need to install any additional app because most smartphones come with a native QR code scanner. If you're an Android user, Google Lens has your back covered. So let's go on to my Android smartphone and we are going to open the Google app. It's usually located um, within your Google folder right here. So I can open the folder and click on the Google icon. But for easy access, you can click on the Google icon at the top of your home screen. Within the Google app, click on the camera icon located on the right end of the search bar. This opens up Google Lens. I can easily swipe down to hide this content. And now we can see the native QR code scanner. I can point this scanner to any um, QR code to quickly read uh, its contents. So here I have one, let's just point it there. And a click on the generated link will open it in a new window. So here it's opening up and there is our link. So there you go. Now you no longer need to install third party applications when you want to scan a QR code. You can use this solution which is native to android phones thanks for watching please hit the like button if you learned something new and please consider subscribing to my channel for more tech tips take care and i'll see you guys in the next one